Hi, I'm Zach. I'm Zubair. And welcome again to Harmony. Welcome back. How are you? Thank you. Good. You look good. Yeah, so do you. Thank you. So, what do we have today? What do we have? We have, again, from the first word. We haven't finished it yet. Haven't finished, haven't finished the first paragraph yet, but oh well. We're in the middle. We're going to talk about the eight words inspired by eight verses of the Quran, from which I had benefited, as the author says. This is a part of from the introduction. Yes, still. Yep. So, with this, eight verses of the Quran. What's so special about it? I don't think in the original, and you'll have to correct me, the word Quran isn't in there. Yeah, it's ayat. Ayat. And again, ayat, what does that mean to you? Ayat is originally, it's an uh, Arabic word, mm -hmm. and it's normally referred to some verses from the Quran. Verses? Yeah. Is there another word that it might mean? In yeah, in original ayat is uh, the, 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 the word, uh, the, the proof. Proof, okay. Yeah. Proof, evidence. Evidence. Sign, I think. Maybe? And sign. And yeah. sign, okay. So proof, evidence, and sign. Yep. Okay, so the word verse in English doesn't really communicate that meaning. Yeah, okay. not all of them at least. Yeah. And so I think that's why the translator put verses of the Quran to emphasize that aspect of mm. it. Because verses of poetry, verses of the Quran, verse is the same thing. It's just a line. Yep. Okay. So uh, the, we can say that the original does not say Quran explicitly. Mm -hmm. Yes. It might be one of the meanings too. Exactly. And it might have some other meanings, yes. like verses of the universe, mm -hmm. you can say. Versus signs of the universe. Let's signs use the word sign. Okay, yeah. okay. Sign, it, yes, versus. You, if you want to understand that, that's a good understanding too, but signs of the, universe. of the universe, I think that is good. Okay. Okay, so we're talking about different signs. Mm -hmm. Okay, be them from the Quran as a book or from signs around you. If we consider the existence itself as a book mm -hmm. full of meaning. And so I think uh, we do, we gave examples to that. So uh, the important thing is that he addressed his soul with these eight signs, let's say. He addresses what? He addressed his soul. Remember, soul here means his Anna. nefes. Cha, nefes, I'm sorry. Okay, which means the part of his humanity that is, uh, although necessary and not bad, commands him to rebel, okay? Uh, so he's addressing his nefs mm -hmm. uh, to not rebel, since if we say that the, the nefs, if it's always choosing rebellion, mm -hmm. then the goal here is to make it feel comfortable and need not rebel. How do you come to that conclusion? The original text does not say any, any of those. Uh, how did, okay. Well, it, it just says, I say them to my uh, nefs. Yes. It's all. That is, it's a good question. Well, remember uh, the average Turkish person, when he hears the word nefs, yep, you being the Turkish person, you can confirm this, uh, will come, what will come to his mind is the part of his humanity that is always rebelling. Yeah. So nefs, nefs is bad. Yeah, it's rebelling. It's commanding him to do bad. So, he, if he's addressing his nefs, and its whole nature is the command to do bad. There's something wrong. Yes, there's something wrong, but he's... Oh. Hmm. You're, t you're telling it, he's addressing it, you don't need to rebel. Why is the nefs rebelling is a, whole com is a completely different issue. Okay. But the fact that he's addressing his nefis is the important thing. The nefis which rebels. Um. Its job is to rebel for other reasons. Okay, okay, that's fine. But these signs, these evidences are pointing to the fact that you don't need to rebel. D well, do you think it's meaningful mm -hmm. uh, to, to tell Nefs not to rebel while it's, the on th it's only um, activity is to rebel? Is that, does, I, that, does that make sense? I think it, that's how it has to be. It's a good question. Okay. I think that's how it has to be because he's taking the nature of the nefis and mm -hmm. addressing it. You can't address the ah. nefs without its nature, w without taking its nature into consideration. So he's addressing the, f the aspect of him that is rebelling. Hmm. Using signs, uh, yes, using signs to show that there's no need to rebel. 
You have to take the nefs, we have to take the nefs with its quality. He's addressing that. So we are all trying to address the nefs to convince him or what? Not to rebel, right? To convince him, to show himself. No need to rebel. No need to rebel because if we go further into the Arabic meaning of nefs, it also just means self. Yep. So to show oneself to uh, that rebellion isn't necessary. I think it's a really interesting topic that we need to keep in mind mm -hmm. while we go through the text, the rest of the text, mm -hmm. at least. Yeah. So, well, personally, I got interested really on this part. Good, good, good. I'm glad I did too. I think this is actually the first time it came to me as reading this, even though I've been reading it many times. Every time I read it, I get something more out of it. Yeah. So that's uh, something that I do like. So uh, with that, so we're talking to our nephes, we're addressing it, and we're trying to convince our nephes, and by that mean, uh, meaning, for, uh, and that also means ourself, mm -hmm. that we don't need to rebel. Okay, we are going to see that. Yes. Uh, and so he sees himself as rebelling. Yep. He's not blaming somebody else for rebelling, and he's not blaming himself necessarily for rebelling. That's it's doing a job for Something else, we'll get to that in another discussion. Though. Okay. okay. So he sees himself as the most, um, wha wha what's the word here? The most, uh, the, uh, most in need, in of, need of, advice. of advice. Strange. Mm -hmm. And he's going to address... Him d d d d are you aware that he, the author, is kind of a scholar, that he can talk about the high issues a lot? Mm-hmm. And he sees himself, in yeah. a hum humble way, the, uh, I'm in need of most advice. My, my nafs is the in, the in the need of most advice than anyone else. And that means? Is this humbleness? It means that he understands his situation. Well. It means that he knows that information itself doesn't have any effect on? The nature of the nafs. Or uh, the nature of himself. It doesn't give him mm. anything in and of itself. Just being full of knowledge. Doesn't mean anything. Doesn't mean anything. Doesn't mean that you benefit from it. Exactly. You might benefit from it, but it just because you have it doesn't mean you benefit from it. He's aware of that. Can I, I have something in my mind. Can I add it? Okay. Uh, everyone has the nefs. Have, everyone has the soul. Mm -hmm. Himself. Mm -hmm. The self, as mm -hmm. you said. But if I consider myself like this, I'm making an allegory. I just kind of repaired, fixed my problems a bit. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to kind of interested, take care of your problems. Mm -hmm. But since it is some, it might be wrong. This might be wrong because uh, everyone is responsible with himself mm -hmm. or herself. If I try to go beyond my boundaries, this is not my area of responsibility, right? Mm -hmm. I am fully responsible mm -hmm. with myself mm -hmm. at first, all the time. Mm -hmm. Because it's going to, my, I know, the, the, the nafs, the self is going to tell me to rebel all the time. Mm -hmm. All the time and again and again and again. So I am responsible. I, I, am, in need, I am in need of advice more than anyone else. Mm -hmm. If I have some, I need to. So I'm going to tell them to myself. If you want to listen, share, please welcome. Yeah. Is that true? I think so. It makes sense to me. Okay. I'm kind of striking. Yeah. We're only responsible for ourselves. Yeah. And so it also means that the author is talking to people who are of the same mentality. Hmm. Somebody who thinks that he's responsible for, let's say, uh, making other people righteous will oh. not benefit from this text at all. Again? Somebody who feels himself responsible. Everyone feels. But for making other people righteous, correcting their faults. Solely. Then, or at all. Means that this text won't benefit them. Do, do, do you mean that? I'm going to grab this book and I'm going to read it to you. I'm going to fix you then. Yeah. I'm out of this concept. Yeah. So I won't benefit. Yes. Probably the, the person I'm going to read won't benefit too. Yeah. I don't know that, but it's out of I won't benefit. I, 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 I won't benefit. If I have that mentality, I won't benefit. Wow. 
then it might not be the truth that I'm trying to deliver. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to take what I understood from this text and impose it on you, which is wrong. I think we got to stop here. Okay. Sh di did we conclude the introduction? Uh, we did without doing it openly. Okay. I'll read the last line and I'll let the audience and ourselves think about it. We did talk about it, uh, ah, okay. but we didn't say openly that we did. I talked so too much this time, I'm sorry. Oh, it's good. You, you, did, you talked enough. Oh, and thank you. And in a good way. So now I shall address my soul with these same words, but briefly in the language of ordinary peeper, people, whoever wishes may listen together with me. Oh, again. Mm -hmm. what, what does he say? I'm going to briefly talk to myself, mm -hmm. too strict, too, too plain, right? Mm -hmm. In the language of ordinary people. So I'm actually, I'm not going to tell you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell myself, but I'm going to try to be a bit simple. Because I need to be simple to understand. Really? I don't need to do philosoph a bunch of philosophy on myself. I'm in need of being, mm. uh, of using the language of ordinary people. Do you know what? The self is always plain, mm -hmm. too plain, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to tell plain, simple, mm -hmm. so that if you wish, you can uh, benefit or yeah. listen to. Yeah. Huh. He does not say benefit. He says listen. Mm -hmm. If you want, if you want, you can listen. Mm -hmm. Whoever wishes may yeah. listen together. Uh, the, 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 tur the Turkish version, the original version confirms that too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hope to see you next time. See you next time.